Don't go I'm Madam Speaker, right I've been talking with law enforcement officials from across my riding about this bill, and they have some serious reservations. And we know that when the minister enacted the Emergencies Act, he said that he had uh, advice from law enforcement officials to enact it. But in the meantime, we found out that that actually was false. And so I just want to ask the minister what advice he's received, if he's received advice from law enforcement on whether this bill actually is practical, and if he has, if he could share with the House who it is that he received this advice from. The Honourable uh, uh, Minister. Madam Speaker, I'm all too happy to answer my Honourable colleague's question. Uh, and among other branches, we of course are in the midst of consulting with law enforcement at the federal level with the RCMP. But you saw that the Canadian Association of the Chiefs of Police, who represent the most senior levels and executive levels of law enforcement, say that Bill C-21 would be a step in the right direction towards better protecting our communities. Of course, that in no way diminishes from the fact uh, that we need to debate the bill and study the bill. The problem uh, with my honourable colleague's position is it is, it's that her party has stood in the way of debate. It's her party who is standing in the way of the free speech that should be exercised in studying this bill. We want to pass this bill so we can deal with gun violence and better protect our communities. And I would hope that my colleague would embrace that effort. Thank you.